colleagues. I've known them for over 30 years. So it's a sad day. So about their families, they cared about the community, mm -hmm. and uh, they were special. Uh, both of them. Uh, they uh, they worked hard, and they also took time for their families. And uh, these are the type of guys to be to buy buy the first round of drinks, hunting, fishing. To be the first one to on come to your aid if you needed it. If you were a friend of theirs, they take their shirt off and give it to you. They they're just awesome guys. And Joe Zangaro, uh, me and him worked for many many years in law enforcement. He was a post commander. I was the sheriff and. He cared about Berrien County, he cared about Michigan, and he loved his wife and he loved his two daughters and his grandkids. He, he went fishing with his grandkids all the time and, you know, their loss is going to be felt for a long time, but, you know, our losses too, but I'm, 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 I'm worried about them and my prayers go out to the family and Ron's daughters. Uh, it's just, uh, it's hard to put your arms around it, but with faith we're going to get through this with God's help. His daughter is adults? Yes. Yeah, all of the daughters are adults. As far as uh, Ron is concerned, did you know him as well? Oh, yes, yes. Great guy. Loved his motorcycles. If you see Ron, he's on Harley. <laughs> yeah, that's so, the best <laughs> heights of the Yeah, yeah he, he just was a great guy. He, his career was at Benton Township and then became a bailiff after he retired. So he, uh, he just loved serving people. Tell people about the idea of what the judge had to say about them wanting to Dangerous. Uh, just like what law enforcement does. Mm -hmm. They run towards danger while everybody's running away from them. They're brave. They don't think about what's going to happen to them. They're thinking about helping other people and protecting other people without thinking about their own personal safety at all. It's training. It's, it's our belief. It's in their heart that uh, there's not a police officer out there that's not going to run into danger. 